So here we are at the fabulous Shaftesbury Theatre, the home of Burn the Floor with the gorgeous Christina Rienoff. How are you? I'm good, thank you. So this is such an incredible space. How did Beautiful. you feel when you found out that you were performing at the Shaftesbury Theatre? You know, it's so exciting. I've never performed on West End before, but being here in Shaftesbury Theatre is just so wonderful. And, you know, it's a dream come true for me, definitely. What did you know about Burn the Floor <laughs> before it came into your world? Well, I actually knew about the show quite a long time ago. It's been around for 14 years and it's probably the most renowned dance show around the world. And, you know, I was always watching some videos of that show and I thought, oh, if I can only be in that show one day. And actually my dream came true. And now being part of the show is absolutely fantastic. As a dancer, it can't get any better than that. And talk to us about the journey that your character takes. Well, Robin and I obviously like a starring couple and we do lots of solos. We also do lots of group numbers with other dancers. By the way, they're all fantastic. It's just amazing I saw them all rehearsing out the <laughs> to watch, there. you know, all of them dance and perform and do the thing. It's just absolutely out of this world intensity in the show. And what we love about Burn the Florida, it's not your usual ballroom show. It's just very sexy, very energetic, very now, you know, very on edge, like I said. So I think everyone who comes to the show, they expect one thing, but they actually go and say, oh my God, it's completely different. But they're very excited as well because they've seen something unique. So costumes, because obviously we love you for your amazing costumes. So <laughs> yeah. what can we expect to see in Burn the Floor? Well, I think you're going to be surprised. Like I said, it's very on edge. We perform in actually leather boots and sort of chains around my neck and uh, cut wow. out uh, gloves and everything. A couple of dancers and it's also there is a beautiful ballroom piece and there is other dancers, which is um, sort of more of the street feel to them. Um, so it's a bit of everything, you know, so it's a great mixture of different tunes, great music music and great dancing. Now, the British public took you into their hearts, obviously, initially with Strictly, which has just been a phenomenal success. Yeah. How do you feel the kind of journey has been for you? You know what, I feel sometimes like the luckiest person in the world, you know, because I found love in Strictly as well. I met my boyfriend and I had so many great celebrities to work with. Christina, do you dance every day? Well, I do now because well, do I do now. eight shows a week. <laughs> Um, if you're asking me about sort of socially, yes, um, with the Burn the Floor cast, sometimes we like to go to the club and kind of let it down a little bit, you know, just um, have fun really and enjoy ourselves. Obviously, you spoke about your memories with Hello Magazine, yes. going with your boyfriend back to Red Square. Yeah. Um, are we hoping to see a wedding in Hello <laughs> Magazine possibly sometime soon? Well, uh, nothing sort of on the cards yet, but um, if it happens, definitely Hello Magazine will be the got only, that. Hello Magazine. You the got to only to magazine lady. who will cover that. Well, Christina Reno, <laughs> the British public love you very, very much. Um, you've got to go and get your hair done yep. and crack on with entertaining the yes. nation. So thank you so much for your time. Thank and you. um, I'm going to sit here and enjoy Burn the Floor. All right. Thank you so much. <laughs> So now I've caught up with Robin. How are you, Robin? I'm very good. How are you? Good to see yeah. you. So we saw you on there rehearsing a little bit with Christina. Yeah. How's it been, the whole journey for Burn the Floor for you? Well, I actually joined Burn the Floor back in 2002, and I was with the show for nine and a half years before I joined Strictly Come Dancing. And obviously, quite a huge success for me with Strictly, and they've actually invited me back to star in the show that kind of made my dancing Boosted career, your career yeah. so it's like I've now done full circle How which is nice. absolutely brilliant yeah How nice well I was speaking to Christina and she mentioned that there was quite an extraordinary story in regards to Elton John and his birthday party our producer Harley Medcalf he was actually looking after Elton John at the time and he saw these dancers and he saw the passion and the enthusiasm that this this very small group of dancers had and he thought to himself you know what this with rock and roll lighting costumes on a stage when everybody said you're mad and I think 10 years after we first opened, we ended up on Broadway, which was the first ballroom dancing show to ever be on Broadway. So that was our ultimate goal. Wow. And we finally got there. How's the journey been working with Christina? Well, when I first joined Strictly three years ago, um, they partnered myself and Christina together. We didn't have a say in it, but secretly Christina actually wanted to dance with me and I wanted to dance with her. So we were both really, really happy. Um, I get on very well with Joe, which is a huge bonus because I know he's very protective of her. And he is, isn't he? Yeah. he? He also knows that when we go away together that he can trust me. I'll look after Christina. I'll carry her bags. I'll open her door what a gentleman. and I'll make sure she's in her room every night. We love your show. And um, thank you. I'm going to sit here and enjoy Burn the Floor. Thank you very much for your Fabulous. time. Fabulous. Thank you.